So let's turn our attention to a little bit away from strength training and more towards our cardiovascular system. So recovery is just as important in cardiovascular mm -hmm. as it is in strength training. Um, I'm not sure people understand that doing a recovery workout and improving the aerobic capacity is going to help them with their, their repeats or their recovery during an interval type phase. But recently I heard you talking and you said that if you're not utilizing a heart rate monitor, um, that, that technology, then you might as well be lifting and not knowing how much weight is on the bar. Yeah. It's, so, I think right? at, at one point when I, when I was in college and heart rate monitors were getting used for exercise science things, kind of expensive they weren't really accessible like that like it just was is a high-end sports science tool and now i mean i think you can get a decent uh heart rate monitor for i don't know fifty dollars right Fifty bucks, 50 like, bucks and, yeah and it'll last you i mean let's just say it lasts you one year and then breaks and doesn't work it's a dollar a week that's let's do it right because now i can like i can look at if i just said to you hey do some squats and bench Mm -hmm. right. your, your question is how much weight how many reps how many sets your questions about how I'm going to prescribe this intensity right so if I said to you I want you to do three sets of eight with 100 pounds with a 90 second rest period between them and you do that you're going to improve if I say do some maybe you do too much maybe you do too little but we're just it, it, it pointless but if I said let's do a cardiovascular workout well we have to hit certain zones for certain durations mm -hmm. and I can tell you if I was training you for a 5K, Chris, I can tell you the heart rate zone where you are going to tie up and you're going to pay the price and get caught at the end. But if you go past this, you cannot hold it. They're going to catch you. So I know that you can run it. Let's say it's 84% for you. Yeah. My goal is to train you in that zone so you're as fast as you can there. Because when you go past that, you're going to start accumulating waste products. You're going to tie up and you're going to get beat. Right? So not using like not using a heart rate monitor like i'm i'm at the point now where i just should be mandatory if you're going to train with me right you, you've got to measure your heart rate at some point so at some point you're going to stop your workout and count on your wrist or on your neck and know where you're at or you could just look at your watch or your app on your phone or the screen in the gym and you'll know we'll know if we're being productive or not it's not expensive